Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to be back, bitch. I like haven't been on here for like two months. Like it's gonna be two months and bitch. I'm just so happy to be back. I literally start class in like an hour and I woke up super, super early so that I can film a video for you guys. This is my updated makeup routine. There's a lot of new things that I do now that really helps my makeup stay in place and last literally all day. And I think that's why I fuck with it. Guys, I also got a new tattoo. This is my zodiac sign on my Capricorn. If you're a Capricorn, comment down below. Comments your zodiac sign. I wanna know, like, what are my subscribers? I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And without further ado, let's get right into the tutorial. Bitch, it is bright and early. I was like, I need to film. It's been like almost two months. I'm back on track, like, bitch, I got class. Look at the time it is my brows on and stuff today i want to do my updated makeup routine a lot of the things have changed but i'm not gonna say the products changed as much because i'm still very loyal to those products because they do work really really well i just wanted to show you guys what i'm doing differently and what makes my makeup stay on and look flawless i'm gonna go and prime the eyes of course i'm gonna be using the Too faced born this way concealer in vanilla And then I'm going to be setting with my Airspun Translucent Setting Powder. So the eyes, I love to keep it very neutral, but I'm still going to be wearing eyeshadow. I've been using the Becca eyeshadow palette. This is the Ombre Rouge eyeshadow palette. And it's very, very neutral. I'm going to show you guys what it looks like. It's very neutral, so I love to use this on a daily basis. So I'm first going to be dipping into this shade right here, which is number four in the palette. And this is on a Wet n Wild blending brush. And I'm just going to start blending this into my crease really messily. I really want it to just be blown out, very natural, not really focused on the eyeshadow, but I do want some dimension on the eye. And then just taking a clean blending brush, just gonna focus this to blend out so we don't have any harsh lines. And I'm also gonna take number three in the palette, which is the shade in the middle, just to add that to the eyes. And you can keep building how much you want so i think that's pretty much how much i'm gonna do i don't really want to add any more i wanted to keep it really minimal and natural take that blending brush and just blend out the edges so now i'm going to be grabbing shade one in the palette which is that cream base color and that's pretty much just going to be going all over our lid i'm going to pack this on just to like the inner half i guess this is like what i've been wearing like the past every time i do my makeup actually if it's not color it's this look and i think that's why i'm so obsessed with it because it is very natural but it is very like bitch teach me how you did that then i'm gonna take whatever's left on the blending brush and just go over those parts just to make sure everything is seamless together and i'm gonna take a little bit just for the outer portion i'm gonna take shade four again and just put that on the outer portion like so so pretty and if you want to add that color again that white color which i'm gonna do just to brighten it up a little bit more oh so now it's for eyeliner of course you know eyeliner's my shit i'll be taking the nyx liquid liner in matte black and i'm just going to create a wing this wing is going to be very very long so we got one wing down. I feel like it's not the best of the wings that I do, but it's there. We'll fix it up. I have the lashes and liner on. I fixed whatever needed to be fixed off camera. I'm wearing Batty B lashes in the style Saucy. I love these lashes. These are definitely my favorite ones from her collection. Let's work on skin now. So I'm gonna go in with my eye cream. This is the Ole Hendrickson eye cream, you guys know. So I'm going to be going in with primer now. I'm using the e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. This is definitely one of my favorite primers. Apply it in the places where 
I know I get oily or I crease. So now for foundation. Where my Too Faced Born This Way foundation in the shade Warm Nude. Before we do that, I need to color correct around my mouth. This is the NYX Peach Color Corrector. And I just like to do this around my mouth to cancel out any discoloration. Now we can move back to foundation. I usually never do my makeup to go to school. So I did it for Halloween because like it's Halloween. But after that, I don't usually wear makeup to school because it's just like, it's too much work, bitch. So this is about two layers of foundation. Kind of want to do one more, but we're just going to leave it. I'm going to go straight into concealer using the Born This Way again. So I'm going to be taking the ColourPop No Filter Concealer in the shade Fair 04. And I'm just going to pop that into the inner part of the eye. Just brighten that up a little bit and a little bit on the forehead. I'm gonna blend out my concealer now. I made sure to get up like two and a half hours early. I was telling somebody I go to school with. I'm filming in the morning. And he was like, that's dedication right there. And I'm like, yo, that really is. Like, let's take that same powder, the air spun powder. And I'm gonna set underneath my eyes. Also set that face, bitch. I hope y'all are setting your face because if you don't set your face, it's not good. I'm gonna take my big fluffy powder brush and I'm just gonna make sure that everything is set into the skin. So I'm gonna give myself a spray. I'm gonna be using the Too Faced Hangover Replenishing Primer and Setting Spray. So it's time for bronzer. I'm first gonna start off with the Too Faced Milk Chocolate Soli Bronzer, of course using this bronzer since like I first started to do makeup isn't that crazy then I'm gonna be going into my hula bronzer by benefit off now because I don't really want that line of powder I just want it to look clean and sharp. Do another spray of this. So moving back to bronzer, I'm gonna take the Too Faced bronzer. I'm gonna grab a small blending detail brush and I'm just going to basically just round out the tip of my nose, like kind of contouring it, but rounding it out. Just to give it a more lifted effect. Now it's time for blush. I love the NARS Orgasm Blush. I'm not going to open it because it's like shattered all over the place. I'm going to smile and pack that on the apples. I don't know how people don't like blush. I love to pop on these gems underneath my eyes. I just, I don't know, it's just different. It's just, I love it. So I'm just going to do that. I'm going to pop that under my eyes. This is just like a part of my, my makeup. I'm going to spray one last time just to really soak everything together. The gems just bring it together, bitch. Ah, I love it. We're gonna move on to highlighter. I'm gonna start off with the Maybelline Master Chrome highlighter. So this is just gonna be like our little base highlight. Just to start off. Cause y'all know. Y'all know me, I love to build those highlighters up. And then moving on to the Amrezy highlighter with Anastasia. Ooh, y'all see that. I'm gonna be taking the NYX Coffee Lip Liner to line my lips. I'm gonna be taking the Carly Bell X Il Maquillage Lip Liner in the shade Luna. I'm going to be taking the Carly Bybel Il Maquillage Lipstick in the shade Libra. This is my favorite nude. Like, it's the perfect nude for me. I'm just going to pack this on. I'm going to take the lip liner, the Luna Lip Liner. I'm just going to fix it up. Y'all see that? So pretty! Makeup is done! How pretty, like, that our makeup is fully, fully done. Look how pretty, bitch! Yes! So I'm gonna be taking my Milani Make It Last Setting Spray. So this is the end of the tutorial. I'm in love with my makeup. Like, this is, like, ah, I love it so much. Like, bitch, when I do my makeup, I just feel like a totally different person. Like, yes. 
this is the end of the tutorial i hope you guys love it um this is just how i do my makeup now i feel like it's not really any different but it kind of is different so much for watching if you enjoyed this video make sure to give it a thumbs up and also subscribe and click that bell notification so you are notified every time i upload a video see you guys in my next video bye guys